Hey, look, you had a, a whole summer to integrate with your two new teammates. What do you see yourself doing this year? I know you came in the middle of the season last year. Uh, what do you see your role doing, in, especially the first 25 games of the year? Yeah, um, I'm excited to be here for a full season. Um, start the year off with everybody. Um, have a summer with the coaches, the whole team. Um, so yeah, I'm looking forward to it. You know, I think for me, um, they want me to continue to be aggressive on the offensive end, um, letting it fly, and uh, you know, just having that mentality each and every night. So for me, um, I'm excited to, like I said, start the year with this team and uh, you know, get it going. If you had your choice, would you rather be that hired assassin coming off the bench, being the guy that needs to hit three, four, five threes, or be a part of that starting lineup when maybe your options wouldn't be as, as many? Um, yeah, I mean, honestly, for me, um, you know, I'm, I'm at a point, you know, I'm going into year seven, which is crazy. Um, but, you know, I just, I want to do, I'll do whatever it takes uh, to win. Um, I know that's the simple answer I could say, but honestly, that's, that's where I'm at. And, um, whatever fits, I know the coaches, you know, they're, they'll figure out the lineups, um, each and every night. And, um, you know, if it's starting some games, um, early, you know, figuring it out, coming off the bench, whatever it is, you know, I'm, I'm looking forward to it. And, um, it's not going to change, you know, how I am on the court, um, you know, what I do and, you know, how aggressive I'm going to be. So, um, like I said, I'm just looking forward to, to getting out there with everybody and, uh, starting this year off. Hey, Luke, J.C. Smith here at 88.5 FM. Talk about you joined the team kind of midseason after you know, trade deadline and everything, and just the excitement once you got on the team, you saw how the city, you know, rallied around you and showed you that love and support. Is Memphis kind of like a one-of-a-kind city when it comes to the love affair with the team? Absolutely. Um, you know, I felt it, like you said, as soon as I got here. Uh, um, I mean, joining a team middle of the season, it's, it's not easy. It really isn't. And um, for me, you know, learning – you know, new people, new organization, new plays on the court, new calls, you know, all of that was, um, it was difficult. But, um, you know, my teammates, my coaches, they made it a lot easier than I expected uh, once I got here. And, um, you know, the fans in the, in the city, um, they made it easy as well. So um, it's, pre it's pretty cool. I mean, in, like anywhere I go around here, you know, someone's always saying good luck this year. Or somebody kind of knows who I am. So it's, it's definitely different. Um, than where I've been, but uh, you know I, I love it. You know I, I feel the love everywhere I go, and um, I'm excited to to be here uh, for the full season. Luke, you come in, and obviously your shooting is is your reputation. Are there other things though besides just continuing to improve on that that you worked on over the summer? Yeah, um, you know at the end of the season last year. Um, you know, we, there's always exit meetings with coaches and you talk to them about some things you want to work on. And, um, a big, a big thing for me was, you know, you know, since I have been shooting the ball, you know, pretty well over the last few years, uh, you know, teams aren't going to let me get my shot off. So it's, you know, what, what am I going to do with the ball after that? You know, I'm putting the ball on the floor a little bit more, um, being a better playmaker, decision maker, um, being quicker with those things. So, um, it's something that I really, um, you know, looked at, um, watched some film over over the off season, and uh, definitely something I worked on. So um, I'm excited to you know show that a little bit, and um, you know, ready to to get going tomorrow with these guys. Des was very competitive last year in uh, the three point percentage department between you and him. Now that you have a clean slate going into next season, will there have to be a, a bet arranged here of some sort between you and him? Yeah, we. I mean, me and Des, we've already had some. Uh, competition over the over the summer you know a few uh three-point um games that we did when we were both here um and especially over the last few weeks as guys you know started coming back um into the city so we we definitely uh compete against each other in practice so um you know we'll see how these next next few weeks go but uh yeah we'll definitely have to throw something on the line uh it was back and forth I got a couple. He got, he got a couple. So, uh, yeah. <laughs> yep. Thank you.